A woman is being called a hero after she saved three children who fell through a frozen pond over the weekend in Arapahoe County. Nine Wants to Know reporter Matt Jablo is in the Information Center following the story. And Matt, she saved the kids, but one of them isn't out of the woods just yet. That's right, Alex. She's in serious condition, but is fortunately expected to survive. Keep in mind, this whole situation could have gone a whole different direction were it not for the actions of a Good Samaritan, a few sheriff's deputies, and South Metro paramedics. It happened right around 3.30 yesterday afternoon at an apartment complex on East Florida Avenue. That's where the Arapahoe Sheriff's Department says three young children, ages 4, 6, and 11, fell through a frozen pond they were playing on. Dusty Talavera, a resident who saw what was happening, quickly jumped onto the pond and pulled two of the kids out of the water, the four-year-old and the 11-year-old. But she was having trouble rescuing the six-year-old and then fell in the water herself. That's when the little girl's 16-year-old cousin jumped on the pond and using a rope pulled Dusty and the little girl out of the water. The little girl was not breathing, however, and had no pulse when Arapahoe deputies arrived. They immediately began CPR, and with the help of South Metro paramedics, she started breathing again on her own, and they rushed her to the hospital. I just kind of put some shoes on and ran out. I just knew that nobody, you know, nobody was really outside, so I mean, I was going to, it was me, you know. I just knew it was me that had to do it. Before I even realized that I was out there on the middle of the pond pulling two kids out. What she did, did was amazing. We were <laughs> back at the fire station talking about how brave she was, how great, great the officers did. And gosh, I hope if this happened to one of mine that some, somebody like her was close by. I asked Dusty Talavera what it felt like to be called a hero today. She said, pretty cool, pretty cool indeed. She says she has not yet spoken to the family of the girl she rescued, but she's hoping to soon. Kim and Alex.